Hello friends, good morning. This is Samuel here. Hope everybody is fine. Uh, I have fixed my two mobile parallelly. I have fixed my two mobiles parallelly and uh, one mobile is fixed where phenyl bottle is there, another is with water bottle. Half liter water bottle and half liter phenyl bottle. Right, I am sitting inside washroom. So, I am doing little bit cleaning job. <laughs> what is that cleaning job? Cleaning job means uh, I am in social media. I believe in freedom full freedom so I have tried to give me give everybody opportunity to become friends in my Facebook and many other platforms now personally I feel <laughs> this time has come to unfriend or block some friends I have few suggestions Today I am going to speak both in uh, Bangla as well as Hindi as well as English. Let me complete. I have spoken in English so I don't like to increase the video. First of all I told charity begins at home. You have 140-42 crores of people. Facebook is open platform. You see what kind of message you get, message you get from different media, different channels I have in my friend list where I have uh, given or access uh, they are my friend list whatever post they give it comes to me it includes all media when I say all media means it's a Bengali different kind of Bengali medias TV channels news and car everybody like no small small individual independent voice uh, they made their own channels uh, speaking from sitting in a particular corner some media house with having so many journalists intellectual journalists this that speak it including different different philosophical channel now I am not naming anybody, if I have to name, I have to name close to 100 channels, right? In India, you have close to 756 channels, I have 5,000 friends. So, I have two Facebook accounts, one is MindLab and another is uh, my, in my name, right? So, close to eight or 9,000 friends I have, uh, then follow another few different channels, few personality, political leader, I have tried to see that for many months to become my friends. Friends in life, uh, first what you do, what you do something like that, you try to make friendship with everybody, right? When you grow up, you try to see who is bad, who is good by using your rational thinking, right? I have tried to do it when from 2009 onwards I have given access to everybody. I don't believe in religion, caste, creed, anybody. I don't see that who is sending friend request. I randomly send friend request or somebody wanted to be friend. They send me the friend request. I acknowledge it. I never denied anybody. It's like open access, you try to see that, okay, fine, no problem. You don't know anybody at initial level who are good, who are bad. In life also, personal life, you, you, if you want to be very generous, right, to everybody. Gradually, you see that, you see your friendship level is very much limited. Maybe one or two or maybe three or five, sometimes like that. I have seen my life, I don't have any friends nowadays, no friends. Personal life, I don't have any friends. My friends are my cats, my cats and cats, dogs, all those people, animals, they are my friend. I interact with them. There are many reasons my office calling. They are there. Professionally, I say this is one, two, three, four, five. 
whatever things are required professionally. Beyond that, I have professional relation, understanding them. If anybody has got individual problem, I try to resolve them, but nobody is friend. This friend is totally different thing. So my friend is, uh, I try to be very friendly with me. I, I want to, I want to see myself. I should talk to me first before making friendship with anybody. The third point is, if you want to love yourself first, you should love yourself. To know yourself, then you love others. That is my philosophy. Okay. In terms of your family members, definitely your parents, father, mother, brother, sisters, definitely they are your well wisher, their friends. Well, <laughs> all are not actually the friends who are senior to you. I give proper respect to everybody in that context. It's not necessarily that you talk to them everybody and every day, every moment, but you have their wishes and blessings also you carry. That is your inner core, it is inner core circle. Outer cell is your friend circle, your society. Okay, I don't have any society, I don't talk to my neighbors, I don't talk to interact. I have interaction with the people, very lower order people, like the ground level people who really works for you, right? The ground level people means uh, the person who is coming to your house for a cleaning job, the people who are giving all kind of uh, logistic support for your making a lot of stuff, when you do the lot of outsourcing because when you have a limited time management manpower you need to handle many people and to get the job right job right product and also the quality has to be there right so i have many social responsibilities uh, like kitchen food uh, i have a lot of friends who are uh, who are different religion they follow it not necessarily the religion I follow it, Hinduism or they, are, they believe in Islam, I, I know it. So let me tell you my fruits, chicken, mutton, fish. Fish means different type of fish. I have all my friends of different kind of fish like sea fish, sweet river fish, some other fishes, all the people are known. I have their phone number, they call and they drops everything at my residence, no problem. So these things already, I, I generally avoid in going to market, even the fruits, green vegetables, everybody, the vendor, I have in my wish list. Their names are mentioned and they give everything to me and this has been done, right? I don't hardly go to market. So sitting at home, you have access to everything in Mumbai even paying very less amount of money. Only thing, the relationship. I try to see and save time and uh, that is a good thing, bad thing, I don't know, but I practice it from childhood. And present day I'm doing because of Corona, these things are done very, very nicely. It is working and people are also cooperating. That is one positive thing. What I want to say in life, it's not money what you earn it. It's like micromanagement of your life and make your life more simple. Even milk. You want to have the pure milk, you get exactly the pure milk. The different kind of milk, right? Cow milk, buffalo milk, everything. Pure milk they will give you and drop at your doorstep. And I have made all provision in my absence. These things are for you to come. And main gate, everything will be dropped. Money. Nothing. After one month, I can give, I can make the Paytm or GP, many things are there. That is not the worries at all. So, you have to make your network first for your survival. Friends, what is more important over here? Micromanagement of your life. I believe every individual to do the micromanagement rather than be vocal or everything even for my youtube uh, or video i don't spend time at all i don't spy i sit in toilet i do 
all kind of garbage activities i make my videos i just close my eyes before talking to any topic okay it may not match the dates here and there but i have in my mind what i am going to speak any topic for that matter i never ever prepare a single line or write what i am going to speak before opening my mobile and video whatever things i am making i don't keep any records but it is there all in my my all excel letter sheet it is there in my mind all data i can recall if i close my eyes 30 years back what poetry i have written i can tell exactly who is poetry and who is dead where what time i got up and writing all those things everything is there in my memory i can recall exactly that date friends what i'm trying to tell over here is life probably one can organize few things very properly that is the basic fundamental things and for that matter one has to prepare many many things and uh, we try to be dependent on many issues with somebody that somebody is going to do for somebody even for cleaning purpose i don't do depend on any body i i do my all everything cleaning job since i was out at home even cleaning utensil cleaning car <laughs> not one car two cars i i i clean it cleaning the entire home but i need to have a time to clean it i decide which date i will clean the entire because servant is not coming for maybe whole year but you cannot afford to have the room locked you can clean spend some time do some exercise that's all but one has to be mentally ready to do this such kind of activities and for that matter you can hire people also and give them job and they will look for you friends if you want to do many things in life you need to plan you need to plan you need to plan anything you do it you have to plan for that matter you have to keep your mind all option open can you can you believe that i bring my product from delhi all india everywhere i have i, I have to just call them that i need this thing they will courier and they know immediately i gp it in mumbai you know the place i live from here to vt charge get there are many places you need to bring some place going something and bringing something like you will personally physically you will be going moving close to 20 kilometers from novi mumbai to charge get vt right if you know the people you take their visiting card i usually take their visiting cards i know what are the things available if i wish to have i can talk to that fellow right buy the stuff get the gst invoice pay the amount and i can tell him that look you hire on auto fellow connect him and he will drop at my home or in my office so anybody is physically moving and going bringing same thing he is going to do right same fellow is going to do whole day he will be tired but i can do it very nicely sitting at home so many times so many times critical critical item component where i know where it is exactly available i'll try to i am deliberately i know it for that matter probably you need to make your own vendor list your wish list what you need exactly and you will definitely get that for that matter what is important is building trust with the people your honesty level you have to be very honest in that context people are ready to help you only thing that depends on how much you are able to accommodate them and showing your honesty level one should know each other so those are very 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 one to one kind of relation that is going to build your career and going to build a society at the end of the day look here it is not a very big thing and big talk i am doing everybody is probably is doing it uh, in their life they can do their micro management and they do this retrospective uh one more thing i want to tell you that facebook matter facebook friends now there are many issues i i understand in india 
we are a country even though our we talked about the secular this that those things are very kind of a theoretical thing for me when it comes to dharm and i have seen people are very very aggressive and there are aggressive communities i am not naming now the question is over here uh, if any 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 tv channel or news anchor or for that matter anybody is politically biased try to propagate it simple thing if you don't like their philosophy you want friend it simple you will see their viewer list like that i have 4000 friends somebody is proposing dumping wrong philosophy they are abusing that i am a, i am a illiterate fellow madrasa fellow like no this madrasa fellow they are trying to teach me about the history and they are trying to post all unwanted thing look here i am talking about this hijab is is a simple thing they are making it complex bringing maya bad over here here somebody is telling in academic institute if you make a debate right simple thing you are making a debate or statement if i say in academic institute hijab is not allowed right now somebody standing outside and making that how cholvena cholvena only academic institute that is for 8 hours you have 16 hour left you sleep you drink you go anywhere nobody is telling you only academic institution but for that matter for to justify some all intellectuals everybody all qualified people they are coming that government is banning something it is very bad what is banning i really do not understand like that if i say i want to have bath inside the room i have to open the dress that's all why javed akhtar shashi tharoor all the congress people rahul gandhi rahul gandhi when he goes inside the washroom if he wants to take bath so whether he removes or not removes it is understood right this is a philosophy academic institution is something like that you need to maintain the sanctity of the academic institution where you are having your education right this is very simple thing making complex javed akhtar and his beautiful wife savan azmi and all those people are crying i do not understand at all my again submission to all my friends now time has come i am trying to unfriend my all my friends who are believing certain religion dumping all those things look here i am not here to tell my qualification not many times i have told my qualification i belong to a science student i understand literature i have studied world literature i have studied world history 10000 years i have studied history of science i have studied close to 1100 nobel laureates i can talk and speak from indian civilization even the day babur came from silky 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 route with cyber path how he enters i can know i can imagine how he has destroyed ram temple establish this thing i can go back this time zone i know the time zone when i talk about the history is nothing but the time zone i can clearly dissect and tell everybody this thing very well even for science religion society buddhism hinduism jainism anything you tell me people are talking from america this scroll like to there are many people to do what you know about the non chomsky i have entire documentation of non chomsky i have criticized because i only can criticize because when i study i don't do the all kind of nonsense job when i wrote very to the point answer and they started to take their seat initially they abused like what you know about the non chomsky i know non chomsky has got nobel prize who is they for what i know it and who is giving him center look here if you do not exercise your knowledge and wisdom and try to abuse as if 
Noam Chomsky is not my grandfather. He might be grandfather. He might be learned person. He is a theoretical man. What he has to do with India? Can tell me. Has he studied India? The geography, our Hindu, Muslim, and the purpose government is trying to ban Borka academic and institution. Why in America? Then why it is not starting Borka? You have so many, so many Muslim people in education. All those universities. Chicago, Stanford, all those universities in European countries, you say, London, Cambridge, all those places, you start Burka and we will learn those things if you are in your class, all those religion, if it is allowing Christian, Buddha, Eastern with their own identity, if they are coming and sitting inside the class, MIT professor is teaching. Definitely we are going to see it whether these things are to be applied in India or not. This is a country of homogeneous society in education system. Borka is totally, totally, I feel it is not required. The way I feel that when you go to temple, you have certain rituals you to follow. When you go to Savarmati, you have certain rituals to follow. You don't question, right? In Savarmati, what will happen only Few sex are allowed, right? Male or female should go to temple now. If you tell no, I want to break the tradition. Look here, same thing in, in Sikh community. You have to, when you pray, you have to make some ritual. Is that the beliefs? Uh, beliefs cannot be justified with science. Similar way, God cannot be existence of God cannot be justified with science. But in academic institution, when it comes, it, is, it comes with a purity and its sanctity to be maintained, the dress code. Everybody is equal in a classroom. No rich, no poor, nothing. Just I'm giving an example, let's say, in a school, uh, great people, their sons and daughters, billionaires' daughters are studying. Imagine a situation. They come with a very high fi dress, costly dress. They have, they can afford to have a, a dress of 100 crores, right? One family, maybe middle class, lower middle class, they might not have money. They can come with 100, 200 rupees dress for that matter. Now the question is here, uh, all human minds, right? You know, in, a, in a primary case, you one, two, three, four, right? In top to ten standard, in your mind you will see that the difference, right? That one boy is coming from a rich family, having so many things. Sometimes in your subconscious mind you will find that okay, this boy is very rich, right? But you will find little different because sometimes you are not able to hold those things in your body that that how come this boy is coming with so many things so rich but maybe coming at home he's or she's going to ask her mama look this fellow xyz he's coming with so many things very rich why you don't have it but for that purpose, mama and father, like no parents, they don't have any answer. They cannot teach his son about the socialism, what is rich and what is poverty. That man might be struggling very hard to get their grades and sending their kids to the educational ministry. But I'm thinking, right? It is a very premature to think that a very billionaire son will be studying in a very poor or middle class family son. Possibilities are there in many places. I have seen here also there are these people coming with BMW car and you have a Maruti esteem car or maybe some some car like you know, BMW car is costing one crore and your car is not costing 10 lakhs rupees. There are questions that arise that okay I, I understand that okay if you have a Maruti or a car of 10, 15 lakhs rupees, 20 lakhs rupees, even if you compare with BMW car, it is like no. 
car will be one fifth of BMW car's price. So from there you can derive something and if somebody comes in home then why we should not have a BMW car. Innocent mind they might say all those things. That's why I am telling educational institution you have the upper limit, lower limit, those things should not be exposed to the kids similar way up to 10th standard, 12th standard, graduation. No identity, the dress code is something that initially it is not going to tell you that how much money you have, right? It is going to identify kind of a poultry farm, all are chickens, right? You are trying to grow there in harmony. That is the philosophy, it has to be there. You don't know who is Muslim chicken, who is Christian chicken, who is Buddha chicken. All are chickens only, you go home. If freedom is given, then all chickens will have their own identity. Let them enjoy their life. So all birds to be freed when they comes to the poultry farm. That is the educational hub, what I'm trying to tell over here it. Don't show your identity, don't show your money, don't show your parts. Even don't show your dabba if you do not, the food what you bring for your home, you should eat. Don't like to say that Japan, you see that the philosophy, their education. We are not learning, we are, our population actually, Japan has learned a lot of things from Second World War when America charged 1945, 6 August, once so did it. They have learned in a hard way. They can talk to I to I to America, to Guru or world. You cannot think of Japan, their nationalism. What is more important? We are not nationalists. That is more important. We are not thinking about the nation. We ask very sasta things, sasta. Sasta nesha bolte ho na. You see it in every places, in any state there. Selling cheap wine, cheap alcohol, cheap boozing, tax free in Bengal. You get all those things, short term things, money they are going to get, same money they are going to invest on education. When I say I propose you charge 500 rupees where people have effort to pay 1000 rupees up to alcohol if they can drink the class. For that purpose I am telling you put some camera, fix some camera in the wine shop. You will understand who are the people coming, how much money they are paying. One can definitely fix some camera and see randomly that people you can see their face, how much money they are paying it. Friends, what I am trying to tell you, this free wish concept is an idiotic concept proposed by those Nobel laureates. They are not Nobel laureates. They should be identified and eliminated. I am not naming Indian two gentlemen, one very old gentleman and semi old gentleman being respected. I tell Dr. Abhijit and Dr. Amartya Sen, come to Bengal, come to many state, you see the free wish concept, you when you try to propose it, you send your own NGO people, I know you have a lot of organization, fix some camera and see that who are drinking alcohol and what is the cost of alcohol, they are spending it beyond alcohol, many other things, I am not telling that, those things. You check out this total money, they are one week, they are spending it. In, if they are not spending 500 rupees for their kids, I have given my recent document, one can check it. I have given my new, win, new vision, India vision, Bengal document that can change the dynamics of India, I have strong belief. 60 million jobs can be created across India overnight spending. Just single one parliament, so parliament amendment and tell the state government to apply it or state government also can take the initiative, identify the school, make it one more show, right? One more seat, simple tendering or square feet rent. My business economic model is ready to create close to 
60 lakhs job I talked about, right? In, I, in Bengal, let's say you have 5,000 school, like 5,000 school, 10 teachers creation, that is 5,000 into 10, that is 50 lakhs job I can create. Anytime, any moment, anybody is telling, I need three months time to do that or four months time, but I, I have to give it free hand. All the qualified young minds can be absorbed honestly, openly with a good salary, 50 to 60,000 rupees per month salary. I can tell you this much. The friends who talks about that I'm a WhatsApp University or passing out PhD from WhatsApp University. YouTube University doesn't bother me. You can tell me my technology is bogus, even though I know that I have the potential of technology. What sitting scientist in MIT is doing, Alfred Nobel Foundation is doing, same climate change project, same technology I am doing sitting here in India. Three of my projects, I told you many times, how many times I'm going to tell you, Prime Minister of India presently inaugurated my technology, is my own technology. 15 years successfully working. All C share Institute, NBRI, Dr. Kalam came for inauguration of my project. Similarly, I see my project. Many projects, Inter Climate Change Division, many directors, their present directors, their principal scientists. I can name sitting here close to 25 scientists over here. I, if I close my eyes, I can talk about close to 400, 500 scientists across India by name. Even I can recall their email ID. I don't, I just simply close my eyes entire India, close to 100 scientists whom I interact with them. Even if you people are knowing till they are abusing me that what is your qualification, what you need, right? What you need, those, those tapu kya chahiye? Aapko knowledge chahiye or educational qualification chahiye? Main isi liye bola tha Modi ji ke pas koi knowledge nahi hai, qualification nahi. Dekho wisdom hai. Itna socho koi banda bol raha hai, uska wisdom lo kya karna hai aapko? Aap mere saam ko time mein ghar pe nahi aate ho, khana bejne ke liye maine kitna takli utata ho. As a way that to am up to batai, please come over to where my home, I am hungry. Nobody is bothering you. It is all you are doing intellectual satisfaction. Same thing I told you that Nan Chomsky has done their intellectual satisfaction. If you have every right to defend him, what kind of work he has done, whether it's a theoretical, ground level, practical, you have every right to criticize Dr. Obiji, Dr. Ramarthasen, what kind of intellectual satisfaction he has done in his life, I have every right to do it, nobody can stop me. And they have every right to defend me, I have sent my document to Ministry, Prime Minister, President, Alfred Nobel Foundation, WHO against Corona, nobody has given me any reply, all documents been seen, scrutinized, if they have anything they can definitely write to me. It's not that easy to write to every place. It is not easy to you dig out somebody's email ID and send him mail. It is not that easy thing. Until or unless you are 100% sure that what you are doing it. You should mentally be very clear what you are doing it. Your consciousness should allow what you are doing it. Friends, I don't like to increase this video more than 35 minutes. I was about to, today is Sunday, I was about to recite some of my poetry, what is written 30 years back, at the age of 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, after that I have not written poetry. I want to recite those poetry and that is going to help me and debunk many things that, how I was. What is the thought process? And the same is what are the literature available and their thought process. I leave it to the audience, right? Whoever is having interest, right? 16 years. What you know about the world, right? There are not many things are not known. And you are writing poetry. And one has to analyze the content of the poetry that is important. Today I can analyze. If anybody wishes to have analysis, they can analyze it. Friends. I'm closing this show. I request my friends 
relatives, my fellow Indians, be a little ra- rational, dialectical. Emotions you keep at your back. Emotion doesn't give anything. Emotions at your home, you can show something. But when you are in public life, professional life, you analyze each and everything dialectically, mathematically, scientifically. You apply physics, chemistry, mathematics, biology. No maya, but it is there. You try to make a lot of compartments in your mind and put those thought process what is bad and what is good for you. Still, if you feel something is bothering you or driving you, you please go ahead. You learn through mistakes and come back. That is my wisdom I am giving and that is my learning. I have done it in a very hard way. You may like it or may dislike it. You can check your own life. You might be 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70 years old, 80 years old. Doesn't matter, you can go back always and review it. Thank you very much. Baba, take care. It is 35 minutes straight. I don't want to increase this thing. Bye-bye, take care.